This video shows how to use BigML from Google Sheets to add machine learning predictions to data. The add-on allows uploading the data in Google Sheets to BigML in order to build supervised or unsupervised models from it. using the existing models in BigML to fill in some columns in the spreadsheets. and downloading the datasets created in BigML to Google Sheets. To get started, just install the BigML add-on and it will appear under the Add-ons menu. The application asks for permissions to handle your spreadsheet data and session information. You will also need an account in BigML the corresponding username and API key are requested the first time you use the add-on and will give you access to your private resources in BigML. Pressing the keyhole icon in the top bar of your dashboard, that information will pop up and you can obtain or revoke these credentials at any time. As a new user in BigML, you land in a screen where some toy sources are ready for you to play with. The usual procedure will be creating first a dataset and then some kind of model from it. Thanks to the add-on, your Google Sheet has access to the models in BigML and can use them to fill in the blank cells in the objective field column, that is, the one predicted by the model. Just pick up the model in the add-on screen, select the region of data that will be fed as input to compute the predictions and press predict to see the predicted values. Let's see a full example. Imagine you run a wine shop and store your sales report in Google Sheets. It contains the features and total sales of each wine you have. Some new wines are candidates to become part of your wine chart. Can we predict which of them will sell better? Using the add-on, you'll be able to add that information to your Google Sheets. The first step is uploading the historical data to BigML. This data will be used to create a dataset, summarizing all the statistical information.
A decision tree model will analyze the data set and build the rules to predict total sales. When new ones features are run through the model, the expected sales are predicted. In this case, the objective is to predict a number. In other cases, your objective will be to classify things. For instance, whether or not a customer will turn. You can create a model to predict that, based on historical churn data and upload the data from your new customers to BigML. Create a dataset with it and use the model to create predictions for their churn using BigML's batch prediction. The predictions can now be downloaded to your Google Sheets thanks to the BigML add-on. As you see, different scenarios can be handled with WikiMail's predictive models, and more kinds of machine learning algorithms are available. Anomaly detectors to find anomalies in your data, clusters to detect similar instances, and many more. Please check their usage at our detailed education videos at wikiml.com education videos. You're ready to start your machine learning journey with WikiMail's add-on. Enjoy!